What's up, Better Days? This morning we're out on Couch of the Lake. I've got a couple hours before work. I've got my bobby garlands. I'm ready to catch crappie. But I'm also gonna try to catch some bass, maybe even some hybrids. I've brought a, a bigger pole with a bigger lure. I'm gonna try to throw a paddle tail swim bait at them. And uh, I, you know, I, I do that. I come out and I make these plans and then the lure of the crappie is just too much. So we'll see if I can fend off the call, the siren song of the crappie. Oh wow, we got a good fish already. First fish of the day. Looks like it's a hybrid. Head shake like a catfish. Let's try not to lose it. Head shakes like a catfish. Coming up, he's coming up. He may be a bass. Alright. This is what we were hoping to see. Something that's oh not hybrids and it broke me off. It broke me off. I had two of these jigs on here, it broke one off. <sighs> that hurts. That was a big fish. was a big fish. I mean, five plus pounds, easy. Got one on the side of the boat. I'm hanging my bobby garlands over the edge just so I can have more lures out. And we've got our official first fish of the day. Doggone it. I'm gonna tell myself that was a catfish. That way I don't feel so bad. It really felt like a catfish. All right. There, crappie thump. Nice crappie. He may even keep. Oh yeah, it's ten and a half. Nice crappie. There's another crappie. I'm telling y'all, I hook up with the first fish of the day and it's not a crappie, it's what I'm after. And then I just, I can't help it. I gotta go after these crappie. It's just, they're too much fun to catch. It's so much fun. Now, he's a little short. They're way up shallow. I just casted towards the bank. Hooked one quick. Oh, he's not running like a crappie. Yeah, he is. Man, he swallowed it. right next to the boat. <laughs> wow, 
that. It's not the smallest crappie I've ever caught, but it's right up there with one of the smallest. Got one on the side of the boat. Pretty decent fish. He's not gonna go 10, but He's decent. For not fishing and just having it sitting in my lap, that's a pretty good catch. Oh, we had that crappie thump. Oh, he come back for it. He may not be hooked very well. He's not hooked very well. Golly, he, he is not hooked very well. What do, what do I mean when I say he's not hooked very well? Look at that. Look where it's got him. How easily it just pops right out. He's close, but I don't think he'll go. No. Nine, 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 nine. <laughs> Got one under the boat. Little feller. He ate a big old minnow, though. This is a Berkeley Realistic three inch minnow. I don't have it set up with doubles, I just have one on there. But he munched it. Got him. So funny. I could see him looking at my lure. I've got the um, lures where I can see them on the fish finder. And they're just sitting there creating a, a steady line like I showed you earlier. And then I saw a little... Sp if I could show you guys this thing right back down there okay that's those are the two jigs dropping sitting at about six or eight let's drop it a little farther than that there we go okay so I'm sitting there watching this and then you see what looks like a fish staring at the top one he actually ended up biting the bottom one but you could see that he was looking at it like what the heck is this <laughs> that's funny That's the two jigs just sitting there. Then if you see a little mound pull up to it, you know there's a fish looking at it. It's funny. There's one. He feels like he's got some size to him. Yeah, he just laid over. <laughs> going to be a keeper. My goodness. Oh, there's a fish. That didn't feel like a crappie though. It felt like a yellow bass or something. Oh, it's a crappie. Cool back-to-back -back fish. Back-to-back -back casts. That's good. That's good. Maybe I'm finding them. There's a little one. Mm -hmm. He's close. We'll have to measure him before we just throw him back for sure. Let's see here. Oh, he's good. He's a keeper. 
Okay. Back to back casts again, that's pretty good. Uh, that's three casts in a row. We're on a little heater behind the boat. I'm having to cast over my head behind me. But I found a little pocket of crappie over there. Oh, he's not going to come in. He's just barely stuck. Golly. Just barely stuck. Oh, got one. One hit off the side here we had doubles had one in my hand when I caught this one that's good that's good got one under the boat oh he feels good he's not 10 though doggone it good fight good fish just not up to snuff. That was an on time hook set right there. Just a little crappie though. I told you I wouldn't be able to resist the siren song of the crappie. It's like Homer's Odyssey out here. There come things just beckoning me in. Yeah, it wouldn't have been wise to be out. My shingles blew off my roof. My privacy fence fell over. My picnic table went into the neighbor's yard. It was just brutal. Right. Yeah. It was a rough one yesterday. Oh, that's a nice one. Uh, oh, he just jumped off the hook. Son of a fish. Most of my fish, though, have come from these right here that I've just got sitting over the side. That close? I've got one on each side. Yeah, I've caught 10 off the edge of the boat. Got one on the side of the boat right here. See, I didn't reel it in. It was just sitting right there at that depth. And he just come up and smacked it. Yeah, look, I won't reel it or do anything. I'll just put it right back out at that same depth. Okay, brother. It's not the it's not my anchor. Not long enough. There is. Oh, got another one. Did you see that? So it what it is is. My friend Keith put his anchor down here two years ago and it got stuck here. So this anchor is stuck and it won't come up. And it's just in the perfect spot. And right now I'm hooked up to it with my anchor trolley.
There's one. Neat. Got him. <laughs> another one right off the side of the boat. They're really fired up under the boat today. I've got another one off the side of the boat. He got away. <laughs> Got one trolling. Come on, be a keeper. No, he ain't a keeper, and he's gonna be probably the last fish of the day. Bummer. Well, that was a lot of fun. I made a new friend and. Got to catch a few fish, got a couple keepers. When this place was completely overcast, the fishing was a lot better. It, it was better early than it has been late. As it's clearing out with this blue sky and north wind, the fishing's kind of slowed down. And you really respect that where we live. That north breeze, typically not very good for fishing. Bluebird sky, definitely not the best condition, but we had a lot of fun and we gotta, we gotta hit it. We gotta go to work. We gotta go sell barbecue. I tell people where to go fishing. If you like that kind of thing, consider subscribing. Thanks for watching, you guys. Have a better day.